Hello there! Welcome back to, uh, Her Lie, I Tried to Believe. <sighs> I'm just, I'm, I want to know what's going on here. We haven't even really met the chick yet, but we're going to keep on going. Oh, and Discord and all that will be in the description down below. Yada, 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 if you want to join. Here we go. Her smile changed, too. The one's faint, but noticeable ro ra Rathman no longer in the and then to do from it I it was cold like the thing I thought I had once seen in her eyes she finally looked at me the way I had always looked at her I guess I had opened her eyes and see for me, saw me for who I, who I truly was. <laughs> Good thing nobody here knows what I truly. Okay, been here for like a freaking year. Most likely they already know that I'm lazy. Yeah, either way, <laughs> I didn't even feel bad Did about it. At least I thought I didn't. If at the if I had any feelings back, then they were probably numbered by this overburning thing we call ego. She also stopped saying her usual line when she beat me. She didn't did continue to say something all all right, but. It was no longer no that annoying line listed. It was something like, Are you even trying? And she said it as often as she could. She no longer said it when we were simply competing against each other. Others at running, but also when we reached our report card the report cards and even during games of chance so she's el bitch <laughs> my elementary school life ended with an extremely bitter aftertaste i had I had because I the laughed actually laughing stock of the class and I somehow had helped Cassandra become even better than she already was a complete different indeed complete different indeed but there w would be another chance for me to prove my worth. I knew there would. A chance to crush her, that is. Okay, we're there in middle school? Okay, middle school. <laughs> middle school brought some chances, changes with it. Well, not right away. But in the second peer part of the first year, for sure, I became taller, or maybe she became shorter. <laughs> don't I don't know. Since she was the only person I ever really looked at, she more or less became more sh so. Uh, Refined when I, it came to any kind of physical chance change I could hardly believe it yet. It was something anyone could pr Predicted me becoming taller than her I know the feeling it feels amazing And yet still sucks <laughs> Cuz now you're taller than them <laughs> I know this because, um, happened to me and a friend. She, uh, at the time became shorter than me, and I feel, uh, kind of sad. <laughs> <laughs> Either way. Eh. 
still find a way to give her crap. <laughs> for for some unknown reason, we still ended up in the same class. By chance, we could we chose the same programs. Distinctively enough, our hearted hatred towards each other was still very much real, so it was like we simply packed things up from where we had left them at elementary, elementary school. Okay, so hair got longer and she has, she's wearing a sweatshirt. 10 out of 10. Any, any season is sweatshirt season. <laughs> I had to get that in there. Her hair was longer. No, little by little, but her body started to take shape in ways which made it very difficult to view her as a kid. She had been only a few years ago, even I could see how beautiful she was becoming. Yet, somehow, I was still re repulsed by her. I wonder why. <laughs> Hatred never dies. <laughs> Similarly, I changed distinct distinctly. Do I become taller? And I gained some mass as, along the way. Once again, I was still an average guy, but I tried my best to keep my body in shape in order to eventually win against her. So, um, this is a legit real rivalry. I am intrigued and I want to know how this works. And it paid off then again. It could have simply been a result of my obvious changes, but in any case, I finally started to gain the upper hand, at least during PE and other physical competi competitions. I was no longer chasing, ch yeah, chasing her now. She was the one chasing me. Well, duh, you're, you're a dude. You gained some mass. No, if we're looking at muscle mass and actual like physical strength, then yes, you have the legit advantage. <laughs> the males statistically have the advantage against females. Normally, normally. I know people are gonna be down there complaining, but normally males have the advantage to do their physical makeup. Can you show the? Can you show at least a bit of determination? That was my line. Was what a joke, really. I couldn't even think of anything clever to say, so I just stole her line and made it my own. I didn't stop at it at that. I wanted my back to be as far away from her as it could possibly be. Well, that just makes it even more fun. <laughs> Torment of everyone is even more entertaining. <laughs> I am not going to take that back. <laughs> so I started playing basketball to build up my stamina and keep my body in good shape. In no time at all, I became somewhat popular, though I didn't really think that I was any good at it. Good. It was just that my entire team was bad. <laughs> That's all. Anyway, properly didn't under interest me. My eyes were still very much locked on her at all times. Sure, I played the card of being a cool kid. Freak, a uh, fucking it. it went up. Yeah, fucking it. it Oh, to enjoy everyone's eyes on me, but that was just the other way to get back at her. That's one way. I can tell you that. 
Cassandra. Even her name makes me shudder. She had been popular in grade school, but now she had become kind of gloomy and resolved looked at me looked at how happy I've become and envied me. That was how I tried to act in front of her. That was how I wanted to make her feel whatever she saw me. Yes! But also no. <laughs> Sometimes it comes in handy when nobody knows who you are. <laughs> but no matter how much space, this irritated uh, smile looked up at me on my face. No matter my accomplishments, she never once looked at me. That's when I realized that she had lost the interest in our rivalry. It was only neutral. I mean, na I mean natural. I mean, she no longer had the chance against me when it came to physical performance. So I decided to shift gears. If I wanted to take everything away from her, I would need to build up not only my body, but also my mind. So, oh, your core was... Oh, no, bro. You're gonna destroy... Your plan is just, like, play mind games with her. Oh, that's well played, man. That's all I can say is that that's well played if you really want to get back at someone. <laughs> I'm not even kidding. If you want to get back at someone, you can always just do that, man. Oh. Oh. I, there's no way I can't go around that. <laughs> to think that bitch is ignoring me. Like that, I'll make her understand just how much she made me suffer. <laughs> now you see why I never really gave a shit in school anyways. <laughs> <laughs> it took me a long time to improve my grades. A long time indeed. It was all but natural to me. And at, in the end, I had in order other chance excuse me but to drop out of the basketball team to focus on my studies as the middle school ended I still felt as if she was one step ahead of me and if it wasn't actually the case sure no wait she sure acted like it was she no, no. She had stopped teasing me, stopped looking proud of her achievements, stopped looking at another altogether. It was as if snibbling was me, it was her new way of getting back at me for everything. The gloominess of dark the glooms of darkness i had once seen in her eyes was now the only thing perceived in her features and now it's high school and i somewhat have a bad feeling about this because this has been going on for like two episodes already <laughs> High school finally came back, uh, came, but luck was not on my side. This time around, no longer had any classes in common, unfortunately enough. As I try to scratch my ears, this next line loads. Oh, either way, I'll have to read it. Luck, unfor uh, luck. Unfortunately, what I wonder why I looked at it this way. Probably because torment, 
Tormenting her gave me so much satisfaction. I didn't matter, matter though. I could still compete compete with her uh, in the midterms exams and the like. I need and and the like. All I needed to do was keep studying until I turned off my alarm because it decided to go off. Keep on stunning until eventually, eventually beat her at her own game. Or at least that's how my logic went. And I will end the episode here. And I'll see all you lovable people next time. And I hope we actually get to meet this chick. So then we actually get a full answer of what the heck's going on. So I'll see all you people next time, and I hope all of you have a great and wonderful day! And please don't set stuff on fire yet! <laughs>